My name's Charles Hambling. I'm the head of the Knox Academy of Performing Arts. What that means is that I'm responsible for all performing arts activities outside of the classroom, and that extends from choirs to orchestras to string quartets, the Battle of the Bands, to plays, to musicals, and corporate events. Knox is an all-boys school. It has 1,400 students. If we add up all the positions we have for students in the performing arts, it comes to 3,221. Of course, boys play in more than one ensemble and musicians take part in the musical, so the numbers get big very quickly. We began by using the traditional Excel spreadsheet and found we were using up to 38, or I think 40, to manage all the activities and all the students. And that was before we looked at the physical resources, music library, instruments, microphones, etc. So 3,200 positions, 38 to 40 Excel spreadsheets. It was clear there had to be a better way. I'd heard about Optimo and set out doing a bit of research, and it seemed to me that it would make life considerably easier and much more efficient for us. Easier because you only enter a student's name and details once, and the program takes care of moving them around to different activities, and indeed keeping a record of all the activities they're involved in, so we know where they are and what they should be doing. And students, of course, are our most important resource. It also enables us to keep track of finances, so it gives us accuracy. The benefits of the Optimo software are invaluable for our, our program. We can plan ahead, we can calculate reports, we can have inventories which are up to date to the minute, we can track our financial assets and have an accurate representation of how these are depreciating monthly and annually. Well, I was new to this school um, in the last 12 months, and as everyone would know, coming into a new position, it's always difficult to pick up where someone left off before you. Up until now, I've been finding my way around with a lot of the resources um, that we have. For us, it was a very, very big motivation to, to have Optimo come in and help us with that task. To look at it in corporate terms, I'd call it uh, a resources management system. In short, it looks after people and stuff. Well, we're very lucky here at Knox that we have a very well-resourced department. But the downside of having a well-resourced department is that it means we have a lot of stuff, a lot of equipment, a lot of instruments, electricals, textbooks, CDs and scores. So a big motivation for us was just having that organised and in a centralised way. And everyone doing it in the same way as well is very important to us. In 2011, we, we opened up as the Knox Academy of Performing Arts, incorporating our dance, our drama and our co-curricular music program all under one roof. We have so many visiting peripatetic teachers and we find that there are many, many resources which can now, now be available for all across all of performing arts. There are dance instructors. We have people who run a drama club. The list is, is quite extensive and it allows us to monitor all those activities, the duty of care, the students who are there, and the finances attached. Well, obviously, as any busy music teacher knows, it's not just resources, but it's maintenance of resources that's key to a good and well-run music department. So having a system now that allows us to stay on track with all our maintenance of our equipment, storage of that equipment is going to be very helpful. With instruments, you reach a point where repairing them is no longer cost effective. So this enables us to write off instruments to give us a history of their repairs and to write them off. Departments like mine are frequently accused of having the handout for just more instruments. But this enables us to justify new purchases and the accounts department can write off aged instruments. It also has the ability to take add-ons. We know how we can manage our costume wardrobe through the Optimo system. The advantages in finding music and getting rid of excess copies have been enormous. But the primary function of it is to free up time, free up our time so that we can look after and teach students because they, after all, are our greatest resource. It's just more efficient, it's more friendly, 
And while it looks like a computer program, it enables you to deal with people. And that's what we're here for, young people.